We have new details about plans to keep your family and visitors safe in Myrtle Beach this summer. A possible summer shutdown could be in store for Ocean Boulevard. It comes after a weekend shooting caught on video. Our Ali Espinosa joins us now live in studio to explain more about this possible plan. And Ali, Myrtle Beach police tell you they're actually going to do a test run starting tomorrow. So what can you tell us? Yeah, Rachel, that's exactly right. The plan comes in the wake of this Ocean Boulevard shooting, but police tell me this isn't the first time they're they're doing this. They say it's all to keep summer crowds safe. The famous Ocean Boulevard brings millions of tourists to Myrtle Beach every year. And as the summer crowds start to come in, it's causing some overcrowding and other crimes on the boulevard. After two recent incidents involving guns on Ocean Boulevard, the Myrtle Beach Police Department has decided to start its flush plan this weekend. And in fact, documents we obtained through a FOIA request show police flushed Ocean Boulevard around 10 on Saturday because of the congestion from cars and people. It went until 1.30 Sunday morning. What it does is when we have areas that we get a high amount of congestion, it allows us to move traffic off the boulevard into other areas of the city so that we can release that traffic and be able to move around a little bit better. Uh, cars can move better, pedestrians can move better, and it makes it safer. The police department has implemented this flushing plan plan for several years now, but only when the boulevard starts to overcrowd. But instead of just doing it every once in a while, when things get rowdy, the police department and other city officials are considering doing it all summer long. So this one we just want to test out this weekend to see if it'll still work with the, the differences in roads and uh, crowds and all that sort of thing. And then uh, we'll evaluate it and decide if we want to go forward with it. Now again, this is still just a consideration. Nothing has been finalized. It's also important to note police have arrested someone in connection to the shooting. They tell me officers in Charlotte arrested Edward Williams Jr. He's charged with attempted murder along with firing a weapon into an occupied vehicle and possession of a weapon during a violent crime. An extradition hearing to send Williams back here to Myrtle Beach is set for 9 tomorrow morning. Eric, back to you.